なんという力じゃ貴様なんなのに我が名はゴー覚悟せよ覚悟せよ覚悟せよ覚悟せよ覚悟せよ覚悟せよ覚悟せよ覚悟せよ覚悟せよ覚悟せよ覚悟せよ覚悟せよ覚悟せよ覚悟せよ覚悟せよ覚悟せよ覚悟せよ覚悟せよ覚悟せよ覚悟せよ覚悟せよ覚悟せよ覚悟せよ覚悟せよ覚悟せよ覚悟せよ覚悟せよ覚悟せ The trailer for Xbox. When you have two iconic characters going at it, Akuma Heihachi, it's a big deal. It's a lot of hype. First off, watching Akuma, you know, be beyond the game was a really like total shocker, and it was great because it's a great step. It kind of bridges the, it crosses over to. Kind of communities because you have people who love Street Fighter but don't really play Tekken, and you have Tekken players who don't really like Street Fighter. So you bring those together, it causes a lot more interest. I mean, you can see a lot more people want to play it, especially with Akuma since he's not in Street Fighter V. So since this is the only place to play him, more people are going to want to try out Tekken. So that's a good thing. I was excited because I was hoping for the uh, the Street Fighter Tekken collab, but Tekken style. You know, so having that feel of, of playing with a Street Fighter character like Akuma, which is very very powerful, very Hated and loved character, you know. It's like he's like a, a eviler Hihachi, you know. Just seeing him was actually it was, it was great, you know. And the fact that he, you can still use his moves all from Street Fighter in the game just makes it even to totally better. He feels very good. He feels very much like he does in Street Fighter, but oddly enough, like he feels very good as a Tekken character as well.、Uh, because no, you don't have like、uh, strong, medium, fierce. You just have the two, the two punches and the two kicks. But it's cool because after after playing like a couple of rounds. It naturally flows in there with the rest of the roster, so it's really cool the way that they were able to mesh him in. If you're a fan of Tekken, you'll love it. If you're a fan of Akuma, you're definitely gonna love the game because he plays just like he would in Street Fighter, and the way they cross them over into Tekken is beautiful. It's gonna be an easy transition. So if you love Street Fighter, you know the motions and everything, and how Akuma plays, you'll have no problem jumping right in. Akuma is strikingly fun、uh, for a character that took its roots in Street Fighter to be introduced into Tekken. You'd be surprised how much Street Fighter stuff actually works, and he does conduct himself a lot differently. But it's a blast. Akuma was amazing. Akuma felt just like Akuma, but and Tekken. It, they they did an amazing job of combining the two different games. Like you could jump kick and do a couple of mediums into a Shoryu, and、uh, it makes me excited. It makes me hopeful that maybe DLC, maybe a Zangief in the future, or something like that. But it they did such an amazing job to blend those two games in. You automatically know that that's going to add like 900 new layers to the story of Tekken because now that we have this character who's coming from a different game, different different genre, kind of almost like a different genre fighting game,、uh, that opens up the doors. Like, what else are we going to see down the line? How is Akuma involved in this, and what path does he go through to get into this realm? And then what's his beef with Ayashi? Like, what's going on? Because I saw the cinematic for like the fight between them, and it looks absolutely incredible. That I think that kind of took everyone aghast when it transitioned from. Cinematic elements back to like a single player or what seemed to be a combat element. I've always really, really wanted to feel like I'm in an epic fight in a fighting game, and usually that requires you to play a lot of it. And if that can somehow be captured, which is what I saw on stage in what appears to be like a single player kind of story fight, I I can't wait. That's going to be really cool. The story mode was amazing.、Uh, that's been my favorite part of Tekken is the cinematics, like playing the arcade ladder and then beating the game. That's like the first thing, like especially when Tekken 3 came out, you had to beat the game with everybody. And now that they're doing a story mode that's like built into the game, I'm super excited about.、Yeah. Bringing the game around to different events throughout the country. Uh, it's been a real pleasure being able to have access to the game. But now, seeing what the development team has done, the Tekken project team has done an amazing job of putting together not just amazing gameplay, but also just the aesthetics of the game. It's really improved over time. And、uh, with the normal arcade version of Tekken 7 already out in Japan and other places in Asia, this is just such a massive improvement. I'm really excited as a Tekken fan. It's like a whole brand new game all over again because there's all these new moves, all these new properties that got to relearn. It's also very much faster, a lot, a lot more、uh, action-paced. Uh, feels like a, you know, like ESPN for like get ready for the next battle, which is really cool. Oh, the, my favorite thing is the、uh, 
that when you both are at low health and you both do a counter move, that move is just going to be so awesome in tournaments and on stream. It's going to create some um, super memorable moments for Tekken. The game looks even more polished now. I mean, Tekken 7 FR already looks so good, and we've been playing it a lot because we've been bringing it to tournaments. But this build, the latest one, to me, it looks even better and it runs so smooth and I can't wait till we bring it out to the community to show it even more. I love everything about Tekken now. I love the way that it's, it's been and how it's going now. And, um, you know, because I've been from PS1, from Tekken, like Tekken, you know, and I still play it because it's just one of those games to where it's, it's always just gotten better and better and better. The creators know how to just point blank make a great fighting game. As, as someone who plays these games, not the best by any means, but I love watching people who are very good at them play because it's, it's awesome. It's like uh, people who love football, they like to watch the NFL, like I love watching esports. So to see people who are good at Tekken uh, is amazing to me. But as far as, as E3 is concerned, seeing all of these people who love this game and love fighting games in general, like, I don't know, it, it warms my heart. <laughs> because the fact that they love them means that the public is going to love them. And so I'm just really excited for them to actually hit shelves. Since the reveal, if you go onto like all the fighting game websites that cover the news, you'll see so much interaction and so many people are just excited to find and play it. And now that there's actually a release date, you know, not an official one, but like a time frame, everyone just can't wait.